is a Manx youth movement uh, where we celebrate Manx music and dance and singing and drama. It's a nice opportunity for children to meet others who are interested in Manx culture. So we've had um, children from all over the island and um, various ages as well. Um, so it's a lovely community thing and I think the children have fun but they realise that it's important that Manx culture is kept alive and that they are a big part of it. Well, we've been doing a lot of music and dancing, dancing and singing. singing and yeah. Me and Olivia have been doing drama. Yeah, we've been doing some drama. And I've been doing some harp. Yeah, she's been doing harp. We've been doing like stuff about like fishing and stuff like that. So like about like the herrings and like other like type of like fishy type of like 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 making like nets and fishing rods and doing like fish like song dancing and whatever. It's nice learning lots of different songs in and rate. different tunes and dances and things. It's fun really to dance. play musical instruments with other people. It is very nice playing in a group. I like Bree because it's a friendly place and like you yeah, it's really fun because if you like drama and music and acting, it's just yeah, the really place good. to be. Yeah. Yeah. It brings together, especially like for young people who wouldn't like no, might not normally play traditional music. I think it's important to bring like a diversity of people to the culture, so it doesn't make it just available for one age group or one category. But everyone can get included in it. I think it's important to have that. People come here and then they'll talk about it to other people, so then more people will come and it'll just keep happening, which keeps like it alive, if you know what I mean. We've just put on a concert, which was nearly an hour long, of music, song, dance, and this year we themed it all around fishing, and we used um, old stories relating to the fishing industry in the Isle of Man, uh, old tunes and songs, and a story about the Witch of Slewellian, who, um, used to tell the forecast, the weather forecast. So we've tried to do a bit of everything, try and make it good fun. Um, this year we did some net repairing, which was um, a skill that not many kids would probably get the chance to do, so that was really good. Um, we had quite a few Manx Gaelic speakers, so we challenged them with writing the shipping forecast in Manx. So they read that as part, out as part of the play. And we did a little bit of atmospheric music, um, a bit of background music, and we created folk groups and choirs and dance groups.